We're here in the Croc Promotions tent uh, here at PF, first round for the IAMI classes uh, in the Vera Tools British Cart Championships. Taylor Orridge, great to see you again, back for 2024. We thought you were retiring last year. What what instigated the change? Uh, I'm not really too sure. I thought we just might do another year. That's about it, really. Um, not really too sure why we've done a year, another year, but we're going to try our best this year. Uh, hopefully it's going to be a bit better than last year. Hopes for PF for circuit you know very well, one here at Cart Masters in 2023. What are the hopes for the weekend? Obviously, we're always looking for the win, but um, the main like, thing this season is going to be the championship. That's what we're going to be going for. How do you how do you tackle that mindset at the start of the year, especially this weekend when there's a lot of wild card runners with things also running here at PF later in the year? What, how do you play that in terms of the strategy for this weekend? Um, all the European boys are over here, so... Um, well, I just don't want to get a drop early. I want to have some good good points, um, and I want to come away on the front foot instead of like being behind everyone. Do you relish it as a challenge as well that some of those Euro boys are over here that you can test yourself against them? Um, obviously, they're obviously going to be up there. They're all good drivers, but we just need to keep plucking away and hopefully, hopefully, we'll be near the front. And race again with uh, with Croc this year. What's it like being? Working with these guys, some of the best in the world when it comes to Miami. Uh, yeah, it's just you know we always have a good laugh as well. It's just a nice, nice environment for us to be in. They're always supportive, and um, if we're ever like down or anything, they're always they're always there for us. How do you prepare for for a round such as this? What how do you get your what do you like to do during your downtime? What like today or like yesterday? Yesterday, today, whenever. Um, yesterday I went to school. Um, I went for a bit of golf. Um, I just got home and then just kind of sat on my phone for a bit, you know what I mean? Uh, had some had some food at golf and then just got into bed, sat there for a bit, watched a film and then just went to sleep. Today, practice day, uh, track looked quite rubbered in when I had a walk around it yesterday. What will be the uh, the main aims of today? What will be the fine details that you're focusing on? Obviously, we're going to look to be quick, but um, it's not all about being quick on today. It's just we're just testing. Um, you know what I mean? As I say, you're back this year. You know, you kind of put the thoughts of retirement to side. Going further forward, you know, do you think this is going to be your last year, or do you want to go carry on and maybe go up into the seniors in the future? Yeah, we we could do a year in senior. I'm not really too sure yet. Good stuff. Well, well, best of luck, Taylor, for this weekend. I know you'll give it your all, and uh, good to see you out there again. Yeah, thanks.